guys, it's time for another at-home quarantine workout. It looks like we're getting closer to opening um, the box and the gyms out there. So uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying this to keep you guys held down and keep you guys fit while you're waiting for your box or your gym to open. So my name's Chris at Cross Clipper on Instagram. Okay, today we're gonna warm up a little bit. We're gonna go into a lot of shoulder and upper body work and then we're gonna get into our Metcon. Of course, we'll close this off with a cool down like we always do. Thanks for joining me here today. Enjoy this one. Let's go ahead and warm up. Let's go ahead and start our warm up with some PVC pipe good mornings. Okay, if you have a PVC pipe, I'm great. If you don't have a PVC pipe, um, go ahead and Try a broomstick. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and go 15 pass-throughs. I already lost count of how many I have there. We'll say that's 10. Okay, and that will do it for our warm up. We should be nice and warm in the upper body, nice and loose, nice and stretched out. Let's go ahead and get, take a couple of seconds and then we'll get into our strength component. Okay, so for our strength component today, we've got uh, various upper body movements, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and show you, demonstrate each one of them. We're starting with uh, some plate steering wheel, shoulder. So I bring it up and I steer left to right, then right to left, okay, with the empty plate. If you don't have a plate, of course, get your friend the milk jug up here and just steer right to left. Okay, or you can do that with a dumbbell. 
Okay, that'll be movement one. We're gonna go for 12 to 15 reps on that one. Okay, um, movement number two, we've got some underhanded chest flats. So I'm coming here and then back up. Here with the dumbbells and back up. Here and back up. Okay, squeezing the chest every time. I have my two milk jugs here. In case you don't have those, just imagine yourself pulling on those cables at the gym. So up and back down. That's what that looks like, okay? And we are going for 10 to 12 reps on that one. And the last movement that we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be doing dumbbell or kettlebell or milk jug rows, okay? So if you're using a milk jug for this one, you're probably gonna to wanna to go. First thing I'm gonna do is if I have it on my right hand, I'm dropping my right foot back. And that gap is where I'm putting the jug. And I'm just pulling up here, okay? So if you're using a milk jug, I would go 20 reps. Okay, if you've got something heavier, like I have a kettlebell right here, I'm gonna go for about eight to 10 reps, okay? So that'll be our movement for today. Let's go ahead and get into set number one. And that'll do it for set one. Go ahead and take a one minute breather and we'll get into set number two. Okay, here we go, time for set number two.
go ahead and take a one minute breather and then we'll get into set four. Okay, here we go, set number four. Okay, that does it for set number four. We got one more set left. So take a little break, break and we'll get into it. Okay guys, here we go. Fifth and final set. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, go and one two three four five six seven Okay, and that'll do it for set number five. We're gonna go ahead and take a short break and then um, we'll get into our Metcon for today. Okay guys, for our Metcon, for our workout of the day, we've got a 12 minutes to get as far as possible. We've got three movements. Okay, what we're gonna be doing is going 10 American kettlebell swings. So right here, we're popping the hips, getting the kettlebell overhead. Okay, so if we don't have a kettlebell, of course, we can use um, two milk jugs. Okay, so we're gonna go 10, pop those hips, get the kettlebell overhead. Okay, um, that'll be movement one, 10 of those. Movement number two is going to be um, double unders, okay? So if you don't have double unders, singles is fine. Okay. So we're gonna go for 10 of those, all right? Um, if you don't have a jump rope, Regular jumping jacks is fine, so we'll go 10 of those. Our third movement is going to be just a sit-up. Okay, nothing crazy. Just your conventional sit-up. Okay guys, so round one, we're gonna go 10 reps of each movement. Round two, we're gonna go 20 reps of each movement. Round three, we're gonna go 30 reps of each movement. Round four, we're gonna go 40 reps of each movement. Round five, we're gonna go 50 reps of each movement. Okay, if you make it to 50 of each movement, go ahead and stop right there. Otherwise, just work the whole 12 minutes and see as far, see how far you can get. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started.
Okay, so that's it for Metcon. I got into the round of 40. Got about 23 sit-ups into fin finishing that. Needed 17 more. So, um, I think I could have done better. I just, watching the dog and my daughter, uh, you have to be careful, especially swinging kettlebells around with them. So, make sure that you have a clear area and you're mindful of your surroundings. But that was a good Metcon. Um, we'll take a couple minutes and then we'll get into our cool down. Okay guys, great job with today's workout. Let's go ahead and get into our cool down for today. We've got three stretches to get through five minutes. Okay, so we're gonna start off with a long two minute puppy dog stretch. Make sure through the duration of this, this stretch that you're taking long inhales up to 10 seconds, counting by one 1,000, two 1,000, three 1,000, four 1,000, all the way up to 10 1,000. And then you're gonna go eight seconds exhaling. So same thing by 1,000s, okay? Long inhales and, and exhales through the whole thing, all right? So we're gonna start this off with a two minute puppy dog. Let's go ahead and, and get started, guys.
last stretch, we're gonna go ahead and do a froggy split. So we're coming right here. Our feet are gonna go outward. We're gonna walk our elbows back and get our hips back and stretch out that groin. Okay, if you wanna relax your head all the way down, you can. Otherwise, you can just stay on your elbows. Okay, guys, great job with today's workout. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, remember just to uh, go at your own pace, uh, break things up the way that works for you. You can always pause this video. Remember, if you have any questions, you can get me on Instagram at CrossFlipper. Okay, um, I will see you tomorrow for another quarantine workout, and I hope to see you even sooner in the box or your gym. Um, take care, guys, and have a great day.